Welcome back to the channel. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to today's show. There is news today on WWE is holding off Becky is holding off Charlotte versus Bailey. Ringstenews.com is reporting it. As previously reported, WWE had Sasha Banks drop the WWE Women's Championship Raw title in her match against Charlotte at the WWE Hell in the Cell because the company wanted to have Charlotte work a program with Bailey. You know, ladies and gentlemen, I want to see Bailey and Charlotte. I do. I want. Listen, you know, even if I, here is the truth, okay? Here is the truth. Charlotte is not a bad performer. She's not. She's been getting better in the ring. I've been starting to like her a bit more because she's not cheating that much now. She's fighting hard. She's working hard. And that's what I like about Charlotte. I don't want the Charlotte type of girl that cheats all the time. That's not the Charlotte that I, that I, you know, that I don't like. I like the Charlotte who's the heel, you know, who fights hard and who never gives up. That's the Charlotte I like. When she fought, man... Against Sasha Banks, she always puts in 100% sometimes when she faced Sasha Banks. But I want to see the Bailey and Charlotte feud. I think it'd be a good match. I think their feud would be good if they book it right and they put it in the right direction for Bailey because Bailey is, you know, coming up now and she's going to get her opportunity and she's going to get her time to shine in the WWE on the main roster. Because she's marketable, the fans love her, people love her, she does lots for the kids, and having Bailey as a role model for the kids, I think it's a great idea for the WWE to have Bailey have people look up to her and have, you know, people be model like role models, like, you know, people looking up to Bailey. There's a lot, you know, she could be the face of the women, the whole division. Bailey. You know, kids love her. People love her. And the magic that she brings is just phenomenal. She, You know, she's marketable. She has the look. She has everything. She's a, a good in-ring worker. She's a good in-ring performer. And I think her app, but I understand why they're holding it off. And they should. You know, they should not be taking it off right now. You know, they should really start it at the Royal Rumble. Start at the Royal Rumble, start their feud at the Royal Rumble with Bailey and Charlotte. And then going into WrestleMania, you have a triple threat match. Sasha, Bailey, and Charlotte. And then Bailey walks out the WWE Women's Champion. That's how I would book it. I would book Bailey and Charlotte for the Royal Rumble next year. And then go into WrestleMania and make it a triple threat match. Um so yeah, what do you guys think about that? Let me know in the comments below. Article will be below. Also, going on for news today. Becky Lynch is turning heel in the near future. Now, I love Becky Lynch. I'm a fan of Becky Lynch. You know, she's a good performer. She's good in the ring. And she's a fighting champion. I think she's one of the best women champions we have on SmackDown right now. Alexa Bliss will get her time, but she's just not ready. She is good on the mic. And the fight that they put on on SmackDown between, you know, Alexa Bliss and Becky Lynch, man. They put a fight on on SmackDown. I enjoyed the match. I thought it was good. I thought it was like the best match of the night between those two. Alexa Bliss showed, man, that she's a fighter. She ain't gonna give up. Um, But her turning, I mean, turning heel, it, I think it could work if they do it right. Because, you know, look at Emma. When Emma was a baby face, it didn't go nowhere. It didn't amount to nothing. She was the heel, and she did good. Now they're changing it as Emma Lena now. So I would be cautious as having Becky Lynch as a heel. But I think it, I really think it could work. She's doing good as a, as a baby face, man. But her as a heel, I mean, it could work because of her, she's Irish, her accent, where she's from. I think she could do better as a heel than Sheamus as a heel. So what do you guys think about that? Do you want to see um, Becky Lynch as a heel in the near future? Let me know in the comments below. That was from Ringsidenews.com. Also, Hulk Hogan 
The final news, Hulk Hogan is reportedly talking with WWE officials. Despite this week, this is from SEScoops.com, articles below. Be sure to hit that like button as well, guys, and subscribe to the channel to get more coverage on all your wrestling episodes, guys. And follow me on Twitter, at the Talk Show 101, articles, links in the description below. Despite this week's denial that he is in talks with WWE about the potential return, PW Insider is reporting Hulk Hogan is in talking with the company officials about how they can move forward and work together again. Hulk Hogan is was in New York City a few weeks back in the unreleased project, but it believed that Hulk Hogan was filmed for the future WWE Network programming. <sighs> They're going to pick him to, to promote the network. Early this week, appeared on Eric Bischoff's podcast and responded to a recent WrestleMania return. Tease, his daughter Brooke made TMZ Sports. And Hogan told Bischoff, Brooke's running around TMZ and made the statement about me and wrestling and WrestleMania. For the record, just because, so the reason why they're doing this is because they, when this blows up, people talk about it, WWE finds out, they see it, they say, oh, well, let's bring Hulk Hogan back because everybody's talking about it. It's in the news. It's blowing up. Well, let's bring him back now. That's what WWE is doing. When they see it in the news and it blows up, then they're going to bring him in. Um, so Brooke Hogan is just doing this just to stir the pot so they can bring Hulk Hogan back. So Hulk Hogan can make millions of dollars of money for WrestleMania. Now, for the record, she needs the big boot to the head. I haven't talked with anybody about WrestleMania. I just need to put it to the rest. Hogan alleged Brooke simply wanted to get people talking about him in the WWE and wasn't upset she was spreading misinformation because it was all in good fun. There, there's your news day, guys, on Becky Lynch, Hulk Hogan, and... And Charlotte and Bailey. Till then, guys, thank you all for tuning in to WWE Newsday. And I'll see you guys on the next show. Subscribe.